Cool, I've just been uh, sitting here making no sound. <laughs> I'm awesome. <laughs> Literally forgot to turn on my microphone. <laughs> forgot to turn on the microphone. <laughs> uh, Gottman, uh, the line printer is here, but setup would be a, a strong term. It'll take me a couple minutes, but it wouldn't take me as long as if I had to, like, haul the line printer to the correct location or something. It's, it's set up, but not, like, ready to go immediately. At least I didn't leave the lens cap on. Yep. So I can do that. <laughs> No lens cap here. <laughs> what a uh, truly pathetic start to a stream. But this is why. This is why we have the 15 minute sort of uh, uh, warm up time. Who knows what random crap can go wrong? Uh, we have not a single game that uses a controller on this list, I just noticed. Ain't that fascinating? Answer, no. <laughs> not, not particularly. <laughs> <laughs> I got nothing to add. I don't know what I'm playing, so I'm just going to sit here and stare. Very exciting, I'm sure. Probably I'm going to start a little bit early just to be able to do the spin and then start the actual game on time. I don't think I did that last time. I think that was the logical way for me to go, and I just didn't do that. <laughs> Keep pressing the spin button before the scheduled starts times. <laughs> I mean, I can do this. <laughs> Look at it, re-randomize. Always the same quantities, but never the same colors or locations on the wheel. Very exciting, I'm sure. Something seems odd. What is not set up correctly? I think everything's set up correctly. I think it's just that my back hurts. Ferre has the biggest slice for the shortest titles, says Speckle in chat. Well, you know, it happens. <laughs> I don't think that uh, slice size to total length uh, uh, is a meaningful ratio. I don't think it, I. So I guess I said my back hurts. I'm, I'm, I guess my back doesn't hurt. It just feels like uh, uh, tense. <laughs> No, you're supposed to forget about the rat milk forever. I wonder if Ferre has any rat milk in it. I'm going to guess no, <laughs> definitely not. Ferret milk. <laughs> Ferrets is mammals. We also have no idea whether the game has anything to do with ferrets. It could just be ferret as in, like, the verb. <laughs> Mind you, the verb comes from ferrets, so it makes, you know, it's not really that different. I will be right back. I realize I forgot my watch, which is actually quite important, because it's what makes my phone shut up.
My watch is what makes my phone shut up is quite the, uh, quite the thought. Maybe it's actually about ferrite and then made a typo on the box. Yeah, probably. But Mass Dragon, do you mean ferret the verb as in like ferreting something out, or do you mean ferret the verb as in becoming a ferret? <laughs> To, to use that uh, use that in a sentence, uh, I I was testing out teleportation, but I didn't realize my pet ferret was on the teleportation pad, and I ferreted. <laughs> that's, that's an example of the verb to ferret. <laughs> I don't believe you, Mass Dragon. I don't believe you. It is definitely as in <laughs> my pet ferret was on the teleporter pad. <laughs> Here we are! Here we are! Let us select a video game! Just gonna uh, refresh the spinner a couple times, so not uh, not playing uh, uh, the the Chinese uh, NES bootleg of Minish Cap because broken. Just like I, I have no idea how to make progress, so we're just not doing that. So I uh, reselected the current pull values of everything, and here we go. We're gonna play. Ferre! It was, uh, the, maybe the most likely, second lo most likely Ferre. It is the line printer game, at least the way I have it set up. So, uh, be right back. I'm gonna set up a line printer. <laughs> Speclad is disappointed because for Pilot Brothers he was translating, but it was, uh, less than one quarter. <laughs> we'll have plenty of time to starve to death. Hooray! Oh, no starving either. That looks tasty. That looks exactly like the fossil creature. Oh, and well. That, that looks, looks even more tasty. <laughs> well, we'll have to figure out how to eat it next time. I, that, 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 that's sometimes a euphemism, isn't it? I, I didn't, never mind. <laughs> Man, tell Ben, thanks for watching. Oh, good. RPG problems. That's what, oh, hey, look at that. I shoved him out through the door. Amazing. <laughs> they accidentally solved the uh, the RPG problems. I can charge your PP and can cure stone illness. And he can charge your PP pee -pee and soften. <laughs> Guys, I <laughs> This is a this is this is this is this is a kids show. Uh, mm, mm, uh, that was an interesting way to be running around. They're trying to break down the gate. They won't get anywhere without a battering ram. Thanks, brick wall. Well, you know, let's let's just go elephant words for the moment. Maybe there'll be stuff to do here later. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You thought it would be that easy, huh? <laughs> we had a we had a good time. Okay, this magical gate is magically closed, and I'm magically trapped. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Hey! I accident. We're in trouble. Oh man! RPG problems doubled. Get out of there! Really? Really? This is the game we're gonna play? RPG problems? Oh my god. Hey, I made it upstairs in the miracle. The giant blob thing seems like a real nightmare. Oh my god. Ah. Uh, uh. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> no! Okay.
okay, okay, <laughs> just, oh, yikes. No, 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 escape, thank you. Oh, that's not a good direction to escape in. Oh, I'm gonna die. No, no, this has all gone wrong. No, 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 just keep running. Oh god, and then there's a goblin! Why all the things? Stop it! Stop persecuting me! Let me go! No! Please stop chasing me! There must be a way out! Hey, I'm here! Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Mouse Cursor, for just appearing back in the middle of the screen there. Millions of years ago. Uh, oh god, the Mouse Cursor won't go away! Dinosaurs invented space travel. Ah, oh, the mouse cursors keep going back to the middle! A Tyrannosaurus named Rex was their first dino knot. This is his story. Oh, mouse cursor, why? There we go, it's a five. Oh, God! Ah! <laughs> you found an Archangel Heart. This still beating food item permanently increases your health. And I ate it. And my health is increased. Ye always a seal of approval! No MP. Ha ha ha, useless. O okay, and then the atomic bomb exploded. Such an imbecile! There is a map! Oh my god, there's a map! It's nine! You press nine! Nothing ever told me to press nine! So, there's a reason why my uh, channel art advertises games and incompetence. <laughs> Shadow Key is an example of a game. The fact that I only discovered in episode 28 that it has a map system and I've been complaining about the lack of a map system for, oh, 27 episodes, that's the incompetence! Uh. <laughs> okay, try not to off-screen to the left. It... Oh, hang on, hang on. Is it hitting the debris of the blocks? Oh, God, you must be kidding me. No way. No, I don't buy that. I see that, uh, you are the... Wow. <laughs> I see that it has chosen exactly this height for me to be at with respect to you. <laughs> I will address your penis as I talk to you. Hey, sorry, but I'm just too busy meditating on the meaning of life, the universe, and everything to make the Dispel Potions. Come back after I've found the answer. How about I put a dagger in your face? How would you like that? That's your answer. Question. Life, the universe, and everything. Answer. Dagger to the face. Be particularly careful right now. I have a bad premonition of impending violence. Oh, dear. Get down! Oh, hello. Oh, no! The pain... No! It fills me. Is it burning? The poison... I cannot heal. Oh, my God! They killed a character who's been in the game since the beginning! The pain... It fills <laughs> me. Is it I, burning? I, I need the poison cure! The poison... I cannot heal. I, I need the poison cure really quickly now! Uh, 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 I, I'm gonna go to the apothecary, I'm gonna ask for the poison cure, I, I don't know if that's gonna be the cure to this poison. You are under arrest for suspicion No, of I need to get the poison you cure! Go with me to the Hall of Kings, Amesos. No, 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 no! No, I need the poison cure! <laughs> oh dear. Okay, okay, I've got the pills, now let's go and recreate all of those events. Is a ritualist. Okay! 
Be particularly careful right now. I have a bad premonition of impending violence. Get down! Eh. I know you, you jerk! How dare you act against me? We're part of the same guild! What has happened? Guards, to me! Trouble! I'm taken away if I... Oh, oh. Rakesh is unconscious, but he will live. <laughs> he was struck by the point. Oh, and the God, if I had had more foresight! Assassin, Prince of Shapir, and make him face justice. <laughs> oh, I'm... I'm on the border of actually crying right now. So I could have saved him, as I just demonstrated. And I mean, if I if I need to save him to beat the game, then obviously I'll go back and, and load in that way, but I don't think I do. Which means I gotta go with the game as she is played. Which means he's just dead and it's my fault! Ah! <laughs> I'll make you sick. The flu will help. Oh god! Oh, God! Oh, Jesus! God! Diablo seems here to stay over! He's having a slumber party! Asking over and then Square Collection. I invited Diablo over to stay over and I'm asking him over to look at my Square Collection! I have so many squares! Well, so do. If you really have to show Diablo your square collection, y'all go have fun now! Manu see big fruit on ground, Manu get big fruit on ground, trap get Manu, Manu very sad, Manu not happy, Manu be plenty dead real soon, man friend come, man friend break trap, person who set trap die of starvation, Manu free, Manu very happy, Manu like man friend. No Manu, no! That's fine, I can work with that. Uh, she- she died. She died in the chair while I was talking to her, so might be hard to ask another question, but let's try. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's- that's- that's there in the fountain. Okay. Uh, they, oh, and it ate our face! Okay! <laughs> wow! That's- that's true. Cry. <laughs> you will not need to use the word cry in this game! <laughs> I- I can- Please continue to hold. This is a complicated setup. I believe that it is true. <laughs> I will need to use the word cry a lot. Experience is too also though. Oh, and we can use some yep. points. We yep. can yep. we can increase our chili and fine and potty. <laughs> It is the duty of all those in Tarna to care for her people. And the humans are as much the people of Tarna as the lion tars. No, they're not. We all know we're second-class citizens. That's fantastic. She seems like a meat shield. Scare I love how this guy Drugla! just looks constipated. <laughs> like, I guarantee you this is the last frame there's, before there's a like, lot to his say head here. would explode. Well, no, no, his head is mid-exploding out of his German flag hat, and the message here, and I really can't emphasize this enough, is scattered drug law. What? Hi, I'm Miki. Do you like Sega games? No. I can't believe it. If you don't like the game, why have you played so far? <laughs> that is an excellent question, Mickey. Good to elf you. Good. Good to elf you. Machine is Dada. This is all Dada. This entire game is some kind of Dada is nightmare. Ooh, 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 ooh! Snack, snack, snack. Oh no, I don't have my- I don't have my simulants out. My, my sim- simulacrums out. Oh no, no, no. Oh god, that was a buttered popcorn flavor jelly beer. Oh. Oh. I got buttered popcorn plus bubble gum. Nah. Nah.
This is the worst tasting butterfly yet. I'm such a rockin' dude. I obviously have total confidence in my own ability. So are you ready to get it on, Spanky? <laughs> I'm not a pervert! Me and this gimp are gonna get it on Spanky style. I am Lin Chin, Lord of the Flame. I found out the total altar is located in Liu Pan Mountain and is thinking about Islam! <laughs> Moorish Mountains, the worst <laughs> kind. Was arrested. Thank you, Master, for saving me. Now, I let's go and destroy them together. He actually joined me. Wow, he's following me along. And there's a little Jolly Roger in the corner of the screen. What the hell are you doing there? The totally unauthorized Chinese bootleg of Resident Evil for NES is a better game than Resident Evil 2 for Gamecom, which was an oh. authorized port. It's it's just better. It's just better put together. It's less glitchy. It is glitchy, but it, it's less glitchy. The puzzles are less just unexplained. It's a better game. It's a better game. But that'll be for some other time. When a Chinese bootleg is better than an officially released game, <laughs> that the, the world means nothing. <laughs> What a perfect, what a perfect last, uh, uh, thought. <laughs> Ugh. Stop just ba stop babbling, give me your fairy dust. Do drop, you silly, silly thing. But, I mean, meet me later, you know, I just want to do a little experiment about singing on. Not... Okay, uh, my apologies, that was actually more complicated than I expected it to be, and I am not a hundred percent sure that it is actually working, but, uh, we'll see, we'll see, I guess. So, here's how this works, I am recording both the camera and the, uh, the, 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 the direct output. So you'll see the direct output on the screen. It is also being printed out, and then later in editing, I can maybe make that amazing. Uh, so let me go ahead and announce the stream as it is. And that should be that. So let's go ahead and play a video game. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> You appear to be lying in an exceedingly dark room, and you feel as if you have been sleeping for ages. You are very drowsy. Your body appears to be quite heavy and feels partially numbed. You know what? I don't even need my headphones. I don't need my headphones. <laughs> this game starts with asking art of you, mighty sussy, says Speckled in chat. <laughs> uh, uh, there don't appear to be any exits from this, in the, from this room. Uh, let's check my inventory. You aren't carrying anything. That's unsurprising. That's unsurprising. Uh, okay, there don't appear to be any exits from this room. Uh, open eyes. <laughs> you can't open them! Uh... Check self for injuries? I don't think that makes any sense. Don't know the word check. Uh, I mean, look around isn't going to work. It doesn't even know the word around. <laughs> How about just look? Yeah. By the way, uh, that is the definite real sound of the printer quite close to me, so, you know. <laughs> Say la vie. Uh, any exits? Boy, I'm just like instantly, I have no clue what's going on. <laughs> Such failure. Uh, touch room, suggests Veclad. 
Touching that has no effect. Grope around. <laughs> Still doesn't know the word around, but it knows grope. So I should be able to grope. What would you like to do that with? One second, I gotta, uh, I gotta adjust the, uh, the stream view of things, because right now the, uh, uh, the text is about to overwhelm the, uh, <laughs> the actual chat. <laughs> let's, uh, let's get it something like that. Let's get it somewhere like that. That'll do. Grope self suggests Speclad in chat. I mean, that might be fun, but I don't think it would particularly achieve anything. Wake up? You were already awake, or did you think it was a dream? Nightmare? Uh, I thought it might be a dream. Nightmare? Uh, stand up. As you attempt to stand up, the lid of your room bounces up due to the impact of your head. Aha! Push lid! There is an ominous creaking sound followed by a clunk. Let me just check that the paper is in the correct place. Uh, followed by clunk. Light encircles your body, temporarily blinding you. Twilight room! Your eyes appear to have adjusted to the light beyond your shell-like cover. You can see a number of machines dotted with switches and readouts. You know, readouts like a line printer might have. <laughs> uh, let's see. Can I, like now, can I stand up? Uh, okay, I'm still, I'm still within the box, within the box, apparently. It's, uh, <laughs> uh, look at machines. They look all right to me. I like, I like machines, you know, everybody likes machines. That's nice and blurry. Uh, please, please unblur. Please unblur. Please, like, try. Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I could probably zoom in a little bit more, too. They look all right to me. I like the look of boxes. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, look at readouts. They look all right to me. I like the look of readouts, too. <laughs> There's definitely a, a problem with how the hand reveals has been Whitman and Chet. <laughs> open lid, suggests Beckland. I mean, I already opened the lid. I pushed the lid. You can't open that. Don't be ridiculous. Dang it. Isn't this supposed to have a uh, fixed focus? Okay, one, one moment. I had to figure out how to get a fixed focus mode on this. Uh... There we go. Close lid, go back to sleep, says Van Whitman in chat. What a brilliant idea. I'll just do that. Get this out of the way. Uh, approach machine. <laughs> I don't know the word a pro. <laughs> By the way, this, this particular game only has five letter commands, hence why it's abbreviating everything in quite ludicrous ways. Uh, let's see. Dotted with switches and readouts. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna need to change something about how this setup is working, because it's not working. Wait a minute, the machines look all right to me, not to you. By the way, I have a bright light set up for this, but uh, the rolling shutter effect is gone. It's gone. It was horrible and now it's gone. It's magically fixed itself. So we're just going to accept that. Uh, let me get it a little bit less spotlighty than that. That seems good. Touching them has no effect. Okay, one second. I actually need to grope machines. I actually need to fix this because 
Every time it prints out a bit, the uh, the paper risks jamming back into the machine. <laughs> so g give me give me a second. I gotta actually fix that. If you wanna, we'll wanna figure something out. Anyway, so yeah, eventually they'll give me fairy dust. Big gape. Here is God the tattoo. They call me Big Gape. Oh, good job breaking it, hero. Our man was a load-bearing boss. Don't you know that? The only reason I'm going here is to see if it triggers an event. Aha! An event. Ilden actually cares. Wake up. Can't you learn to act like a real mystic? Ilden. Decide for yourself what you're going to do from now on. I'll escort you a little longer. Oh, thank Jeebus, I at least got him back. I'll tell you exactly what I want. Oh, everybody else came back! Oh! oh. I like oh, his... Oh, good lord. Wow. I like his biceps here, that's nice. Well, oh, that yeah, was... he's... That was some um... fast corruption. Oh, oh Jesus! Good lord! <laughs> 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 wow what the hell that was that was the <laughs> fastest that it's ever totally killed itself that is amazing that is genuinely incredible that it just like it, it I... the whole game was like nope <laughs> Stop hurting my team. They're important to, well, they're not that important to me, but them being alive means I don't lose the game. And in that sense, they're important to me. They are victory insurance. It's a baguette. That, yeah. It <laughs> it's, it's a very, very uh, stale baguette. Stale. Space baguette. Luckily, sufficiently stale to support human weight. So that's, uh... You know, don't eat Does it. Does the staleness the of something influence its... I guess it would. Well, it, it, it influences, influences its, its rigidity. rigidity, yeah, and thus, like, more of the mass would go into holding up the weight. Like, if it was a... if it wasn't a stale baguette, most of the baguette wouldn't even be affected by the weight of the human standing on it, so you would just sort of punch a hole in the middle. But then, with rigidity comes brittleness, and so, you know, are we actually winning? Well, when it comes to space baguettes, everyone wins. <laughs> Brought that one home! Come on, give me some props! Oh. Okay, we have to jump then. Alright, here we go then. Okay. Go! 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 go. go. We, need, like, go. we need like a rhythm go. to go, go. by. Go. It's like go. A, a, the go. rowers. They, go. they like go. stroke, go. stroke, go. stroke. Go. Go. Oh, I'm down here now. <laughs> My apologies, I had to MacGyver up a sort of slide so that hopefully the uh, uh, paper will go not into the box for the reading paper, but beyond that box. Uh, let us let us continue. Space MacGyver, that's right. That's right, Space MacGyver. Uh, flip. Any switch, I don't care. Flip some switch. I don't know the word flip. <laughs> Uh, walk on by. Yes, walk on by. Walk on by to one of the machines. Examine machine. They look all right to me. Scream, says Specklad. What would you like to do with that? What would I like to do with the concept of screaming? I would like to scream, please. Scream is the thing I would like to do with the the idea of screaming. Uh, go to machine. 
Get out. You're not on- you're not aboard anything. I'm in a box. <laughs> Exit box. Don't see anything like that around there. Look at self. I know the word self. That's, uh, interesting. <laughs> Uh, I... Hmm. My beyond your shell-like cover... Exit cover? <laughs> wow! What a jerk! <laughs> that doesn't make much sense to me, and I thought I was stupid. Uh... Beyond your shell-like cover... Remove cover. Don't appear to be wearing that. Uh... Leave shell. That does not make much sense to me. I am deeply confused. Uh I that does not make much sense to me. I'm already stood up. Can I push lid more? Remove lid. Don't appear to be wearing that. Push lid. Okay, I just had to push the lid more. I had to I had to do more lid pushing and then good. Hold your wish, you dafty, says my clad in chat. <laughs> Resuscitation chamber. This room contains a number of box-like machines. Oh, such as the one that I was in. Uh, there is a door to the west, and yet there's only an exit to the east. <laughs> to the left of a display are three illuminated buttons atop a metal... Uh, uh, one red, one orange, and one green. In the center of the room, atop a metal plinth, is a large chest. The lid of the chest is closed. Fixed to the side of the chest is a brass plaque. Itation cell date of entry 2807-1962. Okay, so entered in July 28th, 1962. Expected release date 2083. Supersore, Ferret Security Company. Box-like machines, but there's also a large box. <laughs> there are box-like machines, but there's also a large box separate from the box-like machines, whatever that means. Can I save? Please specify a file name. One. Okay. Uh... Sign of the... I don't want to press random buttons until I have some sense of what I'm doing. I really don't like there is a door to the west, but then exits only east. <laughs> You'd be super sore if you sat in a box for over a hundred years, says Sveklad. Da -da 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 is the large box the large chest? Look at chest. Looks all right to me. Lick box <laughs> suggests Ben Whitman in chat. What a great idea. You can't open that. Loot chest, says Veklad. Well, I just saved, so press green button. Click. Uh, press orange button. Click. Press red button. The door slides into the west wall with a hiss of escaping air. And yet, there's... Oh, ew! I see. Okay, okay. So I could have always gone east. Fine. 
quite annoying that there's no input prompts, says Specklad. There is uh, in the actual game. It's just my weird setup that makes it look like there's not. If you look at the line printer, there actually is. <laughs> it's just an issue with uh, making a game intended for Windows run on a line printer. <laughs> I'm going to go east, not west. Air conditioning room. You're in a room filled with a large air conditioning unit. There are many pipes crossing the room above your head. Some of the pipes are covered in white insulating material. On the north wall is a panel covered in dials. Below the panel is a large lever. Uh, look at dials. They look all right to me. That's so useless. <laughs> That's gloriously useless, to be honest. Uh, pull lever. The lever will not budge. Okay. Well, nice to know the room is air conditioned. Can I take this box? Oh, <laughs> it's a large box, but not so large that I can't just stick it in my inventory. Fine, whatever. A crystal sphere! A crystal sphere! Get the insulating material, says Specklad. I thought about that, but it didn't show it as an actual item in the room. Like, it says exits and then the stuff in the room. You have entered a very odorous room. Your head is starting to spin. You, Your head has unscrewed from your body and is... Uh... Uh... Uh, uh, not really sure what just happened there, to be honest. Uh, I don't know if the game crashed. I, uh, I hope the game didn't crash. If the game crashed, that's bad. Iman Izaz hates text adventure. Well, then what the hell are you doing here? <laughs> uh, how do I load a game? What? <laughs> we know how to save, but not how to load? Oh, dear. <laughs> Restore, suggests Becklad. Okay, so... Save file 3 indeed did not save. Uh, hopefully it's not gonna crash a lot. Shake box, suggests Fanway, but I can open the box. I opened it. I know what's in it. <laughs> But why would you save there? You were dead, says Specklad. Oh, was I dead? Was that what happened? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> that That's exactly what happened. Oops. <laughs> uh, I mean, just because my head had unscrewed from my body and was bouncing around the floor, I don't know why that had to mean I was dead. That seems a bit uh, overzealous. Okay, I see what's happened. What's happened is that I did not set this up for the game to just straight up exit if I lose. That was that was on me. One moment, I can fix this. Okay, so west is a bad way to go because my head unscrews from my body if I go there, but the air conditioning room. Protag is a robot, says Van Whitman. I mean, maybe, or maybe just, you know, sometimes your head did do unscrew from your body like it, it does. <laughs> sometimes that just happens. Don't judge. Robot ferret, says Vicklad in chat. We have no evidence that the protagonist is a ferret. It's only the title of the game. However, speaking of, I should probably move myself over here so I'm not blocking as much. There we go.
So I can't... I Can I turn a dial? I can't see anything like that around here. It did say that there were dials here, but whatevs. <laughs> Uh, get insulating material. <laughs> Obviously, that do that doesn't appear to be possible. That's impossible, Spec Lad. It's impossible. I'm guessing that one of the other buttons disables the head unscrew behavior, says Spec Lad. Oh, yeah. I mean, the buttons are the only other thing I can interact with right now. Nope. Did you punch yourself yet? Ask confident chat. Probably. Doesn't work. Push belly button, says Van Whitman. Uh, screw head to body. To boy. <laughs> Examine head. That doesn't appear to be a realistic proposition. It is quite difficult to examine your own head. I'll, I'll admit that. Uh... The, the crystal sphere looks like a crystal sphere. Good, good, thank you. Very informative. <laughs> Examine own body, suggests uh, Van Whitman in chat. Not, not going to do anything. I don't know the word own. <laughs> Divine upon the crystal sphere, says Specklad in chat. I don't know what that means. What would you like to do with the divine? <laughs> Peer crystal sphere, says Van Whitman in chat. Peer, that's not how you spell peer. Peer into sphere. I don't know the word peer. <laughs> I should not have done list. I should not have done list. I should not have done list. Oh God. <laughs> What have I done? Oh dear. <laughs> I can laugh. That's nice. I can strip. That's cool. I can strick on. I can strick using. I can strick with. I can dissemble. I can death. I can date. That's nice. I can crawl. That's interesting. If I crawl into the west western room. You can zizzy, says uh, Specklad in chat. Can I? Uh, oh, yeah. It'll probably say, what game do you think this is? You're not welcome to adventure a complete and utter spastic of a game. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no no clue what to, what to do with that information. Uh, I'm going to crawl. Gosh, this is fun. Crawl west. Hmm. Hello, fondle frisk. Fun options. Let me look around me again. Can't open the lid of the chest. You can't open the chest. You can lick, says Van Whitman in chat. Wait, the chest is still there. Yeah, the box and the chest are actually different things. It's a little bit confusing. Smell, says Van Whitman in chat. There is no discernible aroma.
What's the current date? That's the actual current date. That's the real world in the actual reality we are living in current date. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Maybe I need to set the, the date on the system to 2083. Maybe that's the solution. <laughs> Plot twist, the game is actually happening in real life right now, says Becklad. Probably. I'm going to look at Lever, and I guarantee you it's going to say, it looks all right. Once you've seen one, you've seen them all. I was wrong, but not in a way that is, that is useful. <laughs> Can I get a slightly better focus? That's much worse. That's vastly worse. Can't move the lever in any way, and it. Do I was hoping it would say like, you know, it's one of those levers that has a lever on the lever that you have to push the one lever before the other lever will lever lever lever. I can't see anything like that around here. There are no dials. There are no dials on the north wall. Is a panel covered in dials? There are no dials. I can't see anything like that around here. There are pipes everywhere. Lick pipe, says Van Whitman. Right. Since I listed all the actions, everybody's suggesting brilliant actions. <laughs> I'm having real trouble. Fondle pipe, says Van Whitman. You perv. A small animal like weasel, a small animal like weasel, <laughs> used in catching rabbits, rats, etc. Exceptionally good logic game often found on computers. Mm -hmm. Hunt with ferrets, rummage, search, search out. Did you examine the dials? I tried. I tried to look at dials, at least. They look all right to me. <laughs> this freaking game. <laughs> uh. Climb pipe suggests back lab. That's an interesting thought. The red button is the one that opened the west door. And it didn't just close the west door. But the west door is still death. <laughs> the west door is still death. I wonder. Here's a thought. Uh, plug nose, hold nose, hold nose with hand. Read dials, suggest Van Whitman, interesting. You can't read them, you can't read. Hold breath, says Vecklad. I don't know the word breet. <laughs> 
Uh, I, I thought since that's an odorous room and it's the extreme odor that made it so uh, bad, I thought maybe if you somehow couldn't smell, but uh, no, no. Crawl to the West Room, says Van Whitman. I tried. I tried both Crawl and Crawl West. Crawl just said, well, this is fun, and Crawl West uh, uh, didn't do anything. You're not wearing a sphere, Spec Lad. <laughs> Okay, now it should be directly, yeah, now it's in my inventory, great. Eat the crystal sphere, says Van Whitman. Well, that's the natural thing to do. I don't think it will agree with you. You can't tell me what I can and can't eat, game. I'll eat what I want. <laughs> Talk to Sphere, says Vaglad. That, that usually achieves things. Your fervent, you are fervent massaging has no effect. You are fervent massaging has no effect. Okay, so look into sphere is distinct. Can't look into the mist within the sphere. Look through sphere? Nothing much to see. How about looking into getting out of here, says Becklad. That is the goal. Rub sphere, I mean like lamp, says Van Whitman. I did that like 10 lines ago. <laughs> I did that right there. Rub sphere. <laughs> Break sphere. Wow, spec lad. I'm dead! <laughs> You appear to be in a zero survivability situation as your brain finds the off button. Cool. You've curled up your toes, curious. <laughs> so the sphere already, yeah, okay, the sphere is removed. So you can break the sphere. Not a good idea, though. So what does that mist help me with? Can't throw the sphere to the west. Put sphere in pipe, says Van Whitman, but the pipes aren't open. <laughs> Besides, there are no pipes. The pipes are a lie. There are no pipes. Just because it says that there are pipes here doesn't mean there are pipes here. There are no pipes. <laughs> Speckland says you're gonna get stuck in every game until Pilot Brothers is the only game left in the pool. I mean, probably. Break pipes. The pipes don't exist, Van Whitman. You need to accept the fact that the pipes... It's, I list it again instead of looking. No, what have I done? <laughs> Make off map. Map is interesting. Panic. Panic is always fun. 
suck. Always good. Suicide, good option. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to uh, take this list. I'm going to copy it. And I'm going to save it off to the side in a separate document so that I have the list available. Wow, it's a big list. It's like a huge list. Rem asks Becklad. Rem, as in don't do anything. Yeah, see? Rem, as in don't do anything. It's a comment. Haven't you ever used basic? <laughs> Or with tear, taste, talk, rip, ring, ride, revise, resume, options, jig, joke, juggle, jump, kick, kill using, kill with. Unlock, unscrew, unseat, untie, verbosity, version. Wait, where, what, other form of where, wield, wind, X. What is massage, says Van Whitman. It's definitely the same as rub. It's massage. <laughs> Not a great deal happens. Hint. No hints, Granddad. <laughs> Screw you, game. <laughs> Read through sphere. Can't understand that. Oh, di there is a command dial. Dial what? Dial a dial. There's nothing here to dial on. The dials. Dial a dial. <laughs> Don't you know that the reason why dialing a phone is called dialing is because it used to be dialing a dial? Dial 112 says Speckle. <laughs> Where sphere? That's a great idea. What a strange notion. You are currently in normal mode. The hell is normal mode? How do I go into not normal mode? Is there an easy mode? I mean, I feel faintly ashamed that I am in the very first set of rooms and I don't know what the hell to do. What's in can, says Van Whitman? Probably in can't. But I can't in can't. I don't know how to do magic. Or in says Vecklad. Yes. Once you've seen one lid, you've seen them all. <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs> I thought strip would be to strip, but no, no, it's just some uh, obscure text adventure game nonsense. <laughs> It won, and we're already stuck, Lucy. We're already stuck. News, that's an interesting command. Drill, again. Activate. Tickle. <laughs> run away, I like run away. You need to already be spinning in the other direction to counteract the room spinning effect. Ah, oh, of course.
Not load, restore. I tried holding my head and such. Can you examine the other machine, says Becklad. They look all right to me. <laughs> I'm getting real tired of they look all right to me. Anytime I think I'm doing something clever, the game is like, eh, it looks, it looks fine. Look at the plinth. Useless. The lid of the chest is still very closed. I think I've got to get this chest open somehow. DFGR. Super sorry. Super sorry. DF Grant of the Ferret Security Company. It's got to have something to do with the buttons. There are only so many orders I can push the buttons in, but the red button opened the door, which is interesting. I don't know the word and. Touch plaque, says Van Whitman. It's got a rather nice feel to it. I do enjoy touching plaques. Pull. In fact, I'd suggest pulling a button. Oh, the, the buttons look like a red button. <laughs> I wonder if you cannot... Like, the red button opens the door, and maybe now that I press the red button, everything else is screwed. I pushed the red button last, though. I've just backed up a lot. Yeah, the west door is now not open. I can push the green button over and over again. Yeah, I don't think that's leading me in a sensible direction. What does the buttons do? Odd, says Van Whitman in chat. Hold buttons, says Becklad. I just want to be close to the butt. I listen again every time I mean to, uh... Oh, God, what have I done? Every time I mean to look, I accidentally type list. It's such a long list. This is wasting paper right here. Playing this game on a line printer, that's not wasting printer. Listing what I mean to look, that's playing on a line printer. <laughs> doesn't that mean they're vents, says Van Whitman? No, that doesn't mean that. That's, that doesn't mean that at all. <laughs> that means they're vents somewhere, not necessarily in the air conditioning room. Suddenly, nothing happens!
All paper used up in this stream will be donated to the Toronto Food Bank, says Fecklad. Yep, delicious, delicious paper. Mmm. Read through. Stop. I'll just yell. That felt good. I can get off. <laughs> Interestingly, I can spin using or spin with, but I can't just spin. Push. Gotta be something I can do with this panel. What is Guru for, says Van Whitman. That's probably the other mode. Or normal. Ferret release news. Version 10.30 fixes command added to display the list of issues addressed in each version. List of commands added. Revision 10.20 notify command added to display notifications whenever your score is increased. Press with notify off. Ooh, this will action every verb on the lid. Added in response to some test the verb complaints. Okay, test dial. Oh god, okay, this is still showing me that. Okay, 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 test dial. Test panel. So you can, you can literally do, oh dear. <laughs> uh, okay, so nothing to be done with the panel, but maybe something with the lid. That's interesting. So you can try every verb. Well, it's time to try every verb with the uh, thing, the, the lid. Okay. <laughs> so I can't do anything with the lid, and I quite certainly can't do anything with the lid, thanks to uh, the bizarre test option. I mean, I have made so little progress. I'm stuck in the first two rows. It's been an hour, and I'm stuck. 
<laughs> Test sphere, says Van Whitman, I suppose. Well, nothing better to do. I know that there is a break sphere. And so testing the sphere should have killed me. But it didn't. So this so test doesn't actually do every verb. It at least doesn't do the verbs that will kill you. And also it made me drop the sphere. <laughs> Fight lid, says Lucy and Chad and chat, but we tried that. Okay. There's a number of box-like machines, one of which we just opened, or we just came out of. Can't open the machines. Well! <laughs> Lucy and Chad says, look at the fight sphere output. Yeah, I know. I saw it. I saw it. Fight sphere. Don't be such a dickhead. Don't fight spheres. Oops. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so it, it'll only test things that you can actually do something with, which suggests that I can do something with the panel or the dials to the east. It's gotta be something with this death sphere. Oh, I thought you just got two tests per game, says Beckland. Still very possible. It could remember that in spite of the saves. <laughs> Can't open the panel. Looks all right to me. I like air conditioning units. Kiss panel worth a shot, says Van Witten, but I already tested the panel. I did everything with the panel. <laughs> Well,
Squeezing a lever isn't even an innovative idea. Of course you should squeeze a lever. I am thinking very hard right now. There's a lever. I have a sphere. I have a box. But it's just a box. There is a chest with a lid that won't open. The lever won't move. There's a panel covered in dials that won't do anything. It's gotta be the insulating material, says Speckled Jet. Definitely. I did try to get the insulating material, just it, the game seemed confused. Class wool, yum, says Specklad. No, it's asbestos. What else was in this room? The orange and green buttons also presumably do something. One thing I have certainly not done is pressed one of these buttons and then seen if the lever was unlocked. Nope. Hoax lever says Speckled in chat. Just gotta gotta be gentle with it. Cool. <laughs> This game is hard. Well, no, it's not hard. It's just, like, uh, impenetrable. This game is uh, confusing in a way that isn't clever. It's just guess what the authors were thinking. Maybe you have to throw the sphere inside the ventilation room, says Specklad. And I guess it's worth a, worth a shot. Well, that was fun.
can't do anything with the lever as far as I can tell. The orange and green buttons presumably do something, but as yet there's no real hint as to what they do. Wait, did you do anything with the AC unit aspect, lad? I couldn't make anything happen with the AC unit. I didn't test air conditioning unit. unit. <laughs> Well, There are lots of them. I'm not good at counting. <laughs> I don't know how to actually count things. <laughs> a bunch. I don't know. There's a lot of them. How many? I don't know. There's like too many to count. There's, there's lots. There's lots of them. Wow, my number system truly is either one or lots, isn't it? <laughs> or probably none. <laughs> What? <laughs> uh, am I playing two copies of the game at once? <laughs> okay, I don't know, don't quite know what happened there, but it's probably fine. <laughs> The end of the chest is closed. I mean, since this is a resuscitation chamber, these are like cryonically frozen people, of which I was one until just a moment ago. But without being able to do anything with the air conditioner, I can't really do anything with that fact.
The container you were in clangs shut. So probably the chest with the closed lid is merely the chest I was in. I wonder if there was something in the chest with me that I ought to have taken with me. So this chest I doubt is particularly important because this chest is just what I was in. But you were able to open the lid before, why not now, Aspect Lad? Because I was opening it from the inside. <laughs> if I had been, uh, 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 frozen for, uh, for storage, then they would want me to be able to escape the box, but people don't need to escape into it. I'm just wondering if there's something else in here. No. And I have now accomplished exactly as much as I did before! The game that is nasty according to the wiki, says Van Whitman. Yeah, 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 it is. Yep, it's one of those. It's one of those. <laughs> Specklad looked up what to do and doesn't seem very happy about it. <laughs> Mass Dragon, I'm not suffering because I'm just not that sort of, uh, 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 engaged. <laughs> like, the game of the game makes no sense isn't really all that interesting. I'm, it's gotta be something to do with the order of the buttons. Or maybe the fact that I opened the door before trying to pull this lever? Hey, now we're getting somewhere. So now I have clung to the lever. Presumably I needed to press orange and then pull the lever without opening the door. Let's see if the western room, oh. That doesn't open the door. Oh, I've done it again! <laughs> that doesn't open the door now. Oh, now it's green. Oh, because now it's safe, maybe. It is safe! It is safe! Okay, okay, okay. We're making progress. It took an hour, but we're making progress. <laughs> you were in a cool, dark room, originally designed for the long-term storage of chemicals. Unfortunately, the storage racks are nearly empty. Above the eastern exit is a flashing sign. Glad to be of service. Useful. I bet this game is as long as Sword and Fairy, says Peglad in chat. Undoubtedly. <laughs> I'm betting I did not get... Yeah, I only got one of them. <laughs> the labels are br blank. Interesting.
What do you mean? I opened it. Surely I can drink it. <laughs> oh, it's, it's empty. Okay. A yellow fluid? That's my favorite kind. <laughs> Of course I'm dead! <laughs> you don't appear to agree with poisonous substances. You burned yourself from the inside out. <laughs> okay, so I've got some spooky chemicals. I can go south. Yeah, I've got the crystal sphere, I've got everything, fine. I love featureless corridors! Well, follow the left wall. You're in a large square room near the south wall is what appears to be an electrical generator. On the side of the generator are two knobs, one green and one red. Typically a red knob. Did I read those in the opposite order? Yes, I did. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, typically a red knob would be to turn it off and a green knob would be to turn it on. But there's some steel drums here because that makes sense. And a tiny, eeny, weeny box. I can get everything, but I'm now carrying too much. Interesting. Uh, so I didn't get the steel drums. What? I can't play the steel drums? How dare you? Okay, so that's a matchbox. Maybe I just can't carry steel drums. They're just too much. <laughs> But I have a match and a candle, which seems good. Can I do just exits? No. That's annoying. Maintenance room, you're in a small dusty room. There's a large steel plate set in the floor. There is a small opening near one edge of the plate. The plate is closed. Coil of rope, a shovel, various boxes. Let me guess, count boxes. Lots of them. <laughs> it's a freaking game. Mmm, <laughs> interesting. I mean, this plate is in the floor, it goes down, I could use this to climb into the ground. Shovel feels pretty important. You can't open the boxes! I was hoping I could somehow get it to tell me, like, the weight of various things, and, like, maybe I just can't... I don't know. Hmm. 
You're in a computer room containing lots of useless ICL computer equipment. What other sort is there? I don't know, given that I don't remember what ICL is. <laughs> International Computing League. Okay, so that just connects to the maintenance room, which I guess I knew if I had bothered to know. Oh, wait, 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 no, the maintenance room is... No, no, this is... Yeah, yeah, fine, fine, fine. You're in the dark! Okay, 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 okay. Uh... Open tiny box. Get match. Light... Licht. Light candle. Light candle with match. Matach. Strike match. <sighs> Strike match. Are you kidding me? <laughs> uh, hello, Rodney. Light match. Oh, okay. Uh, light candle. Okay, okay. You're in a stairwell. There are steps leading up. Well, I'm making it higher in this tower. Steps leading up and down, but I can also exit to the east. I'm now on the second floor. Steel door to the south. Interesting. Filing room. Number of filing cabinets. There's a purple folder here. You can't read opaque objects you can't read oh it's in an opaque object oh my god get paper read paper rj klein foundation for extending research into resuscitation and embalming technology confidential report subject bo dawkins release period after 2082 best before 2084 Three born in England in, on the 28th of July, 1962. Nothing else known. Patient embalmed due to unknown viral infection. Next of kin finance complete operation with the relevant trust funds and insurance also provided. Patient given maximum of 100 year treatment. The next of kin were informed of the inherent risks. I am B.O. Darkens. Probably. My name is Body Odor Darkens. <laughs> I'm going to leave that. Don't know why. Follow the left wall. You're in a long white corridor. A camera-like object mounted high out of reach on the wall to your left. A red light on its side began to wink. The light is win winking at me. Oh, good. Of course the candle only lasts so long. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. I'm going to wait and see what the camera does. It kills me! The camera-like object is now pointing directly at you. Now visible on its face is a badge upon which is written Ferret Security Systems, Laser Division, and a dial which is set to Multi-Zap Mega Death. Just as you take in these details, the laser energizes and burns out both of your eyes. The laser, however, is not content with just blinding you and continues burning into your skull, vaporizing your brain. You are toast. No, I'm not. Toast isn't vapor. Toast is a solid. <laughs> Okay, let's not, uh, let's not get killed by the camera very quickly. 
Oh, I should read. Uh, you are in a room containing surveillance equipment. Mounted above the smashed central control panel are a number of television monitors. The monitors appear to be wrecked. However, one of them still seems to be functioning. To the right side of the panel is a slot. There's an armored door to the west. There's a metal plate above the door. Do lasers toast toast? Asks Backlad. What an excellent question. Protected by Ferret Limited Security Systems, the totally impenetrable defense system. What kind of game is this, ass Rodney? Can't you tell? It's a text adventure game, which I'm playing on, uh, uh, this is called a line printer. I mean, there's no way I can open this door. Yeah. Look at Monitor. They look all right to me, you piece of shit. <laughs> okay. There's a very specious room in which there is a large table affixed to the east wall as a cocktail cabinet. There's a window in the east wall. Hmm. No! <laughs> oh! I'm on a fire escape! I wasn't expecting to succeed in that way. I was expecting that to just be a way of killing myself, but there's actually an exit that way. But I don't feel like going outside just yet. Let's open the cabinet. It's an empty cabinet. Let us not go through the uh, fire exit just yet. Because there were other places to go here. You're in a brightly painted room. Each wall of the room has a different color. This is a room made for me! <laughs> the north wall is white, the east wall is yellow, the south wall black, and the north wall... and the west wall, I can't read, blue. There's a pile of debris in the middle of the floor. There is a hole in the ceiling. Interessante. Can't climb the debris to get to the ceiling. Can't go up. There's a steel door to the south, but apparently I can go that way. Dimly lit room. So, by the way, I assume that a lot of this is actually, uh, uh, like, lit? And the reason I'm not putting out the candle is that the uh, match immediately burnt out. So my candle I just have for however long I have, and that's that. In the power room, I should have pulled the green lever and seen if I could get the power back on. Front of the... Uh, above the shelf, to the right, there's a sink. Above your head is a frayed string hanging from a rusty metal dome. And yeah, there's the exit to the north. A small beaker containing some water, quote-unquote, a plastic canister, a stained leaflet. Oh, this is, uh, this is a, uh, uh, dark room for camera, uh, development. So there's water, the plastic cam- canister? Canister... Uh, we'll have either developer or fixer. 
Uh, but you really do need both. You can't just <laughs> develop the film and then not fix it, and then turn on the lights and see what happens. <laughs> Can't really think of what to do with this just yet. I should be, like, mapping or listing or doing anything sensible, but I'm not doing any of those things. <laughs> Nobody's watching anymore. <laughs> Everyone has lost interest uh, wholly. And I think just west from here, yeah, was the stairwell. Cool. Cool. It's a bit dark to open the window, isn't it? What do you do with all the paper after you finish it, asked Rodney. <laughs> just wasting paper. I like wasting paper. Wasting paper is something. <laughs> Okay, I can't open the window in the dark. Uh... You are standing in, uh, in the grounds of a large building. The building is to your northwest and is accessible via a staircase leading up to the fire escape. There is a continuous high fence to the south and east. So there's lots of objects I could have gotten in the building. I suspect, based on the runtime of the camera, that there's lots of things you can see that you can't actually... Or camera, the runtime of the candle, that there are lots of things that you can sort of get to but not usefully interact with. <laughs> Something very relaxing hearing the printer in action says Dan in chat. <laughs> How loud is it compared to me? Is it louder than me? <laughs> uh, well, let's let's just start going clockwise around the fence. You're standing in the grounds of a large building. The building is to your north. There's a continuous high fence to the south. Standing around the building, the building is to your northeast, there is a continuous high fence to the west and south. Oars. Interesting. Uh, what can I drop to make room for oars? Of course I didn't drop both of the bottles. How weak am- maybe I actually am a ferret. Maybe that's the thing. I can't carry oars because they're human oars. Oops. Drop hook is what I meant. Yeah, I can carry the oars, but not a lot more than the oars. Candle's gone out. Uh, the green bottle was the one with poison. Okay. I've got some stuff. Oh, the rope is too useful. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. You can't carry oars and a rope. Don't be ridiculous. The fence is literally a continuous fence. There is absolutely nothing. Like, there's no way through the... F there's no gate. There's no gate anywhere. I mean, I wasn't expecting to be able to open the gate. There we go. You're standing on a large tarmac circle in the grounds of a large building. It is just possible to discern a large H. Oh, a helipad printed on the tarmac. There's a strong door to the west, which is blocked by a pile of rubble. There is a wooden stake set in the ground near the small, near a small gap in a continuous high fence to the east. There's a signpost here. Just says signpost, not a sign.
I mean, we can leave the grounds now. So, okay, okay. I suspect we're gonna need to almost certainly fully restart, but to know what I've done wrong, I would need to m make progress until I find that there's something I'm missing, or it's like, if I had this object, I could make progress. So, I'm just gonna make progress. Yarg! Okay, I done did a die. Oh, it's a cliff. Okay. Uh, there you feel as though you're floating. In fact, you're falling headlong over a cliff as you see the rocks below approaching at an ever faster rate. Your to totally uneventful life flashes before your eyes in a nanosecond. Splat! I'm afraid you've kicked the bucket. But at least I got ten points. I can't see anything like an east around here, uh, but I do have a hook and I know where my rope is. Okay, so can I use my rope to climb down? Tie rope to a uh, stake. Climb rope. If I just go now, will that be sufficient? I doubt it. The stake has snapped due to your massive bulk. If only I wasn't so damned fat. <laughs> okay, even... Oops. Wait, didn't I? Wait, 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 wait. Restore 21. Oh, because I dropped the rope. Okay, drop hook. Yeah, okay, even... Even so... Tie rope to signpost? That's not possible. What can I do to reduce my massive bulk? <laughs> Can't exercise. <laughs> Is there anything else? Oh yeah, yeah, it's blocked by a pile of rubble anyway. So what would either make me weigh less or make the stake able to carry more or like an alternative stake?
Okay, let's go further up the fire escape. There's a stairway down to the next level. Above you is a balcony. Unfortunately, it's just out of your reach. Okay, so that doesn't really achieve very much. And from here, yeah, I'm in the dark. So I'm probably screwed. I wonder how long this rope is. Can I tie the rope to the fire escape? I don't see anything like a fire escape around here. Yeah, okay, I can't do that. Just thinking. <laughs> thinking. That would be useful, wouldn't it? <laughs> yep, map would be useful. Uh, I'm just gonna back up a lot. Uh, even more than that, in fact. But not quite that far. Uh... Okay, this is good. This is good. Get tiny box. Get... just get all. Okay, so I have the candle and the, uh... thing. Uh... Okay, there's a red knob and a green knob. Oh. Oh, that's nice of it. <laughs> Turn green knob. Generator coughs into life and produces a low humming sound. So maybe now the uh, lights will just be on and I won't need to use the candle. <laughs> yes, yes, the lights are on. Okay, okay, okay. You're in a stairwell, there's uh, steps leading up and down. Your passage upwards appears to be blocked by a lump of masonry. It appears that there used to be an exit to the east. Okay. So, I do not need to use the candle so early. That's, that's interesting. But I actually want to be here. I think it's about time for my midstream break. Slightly early, but I'm trying to, to change up the midstream break time. So I'm going to take my midstream break, think about what I've done, and maybe consider mapping. Oh, go, it's the, it's go, the rhythm, go, or the beat, go, or the tempo, go, I think. That's... Go, go, go. Oh my god. Okay, can we save here, please? Yeah, yeah, oh, no. We don't no, have to save. Just, just leave. Oh, just leave. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was so much concentration. <laughs>
Oh my. Your inventory is full! Oh well, too bad! Are you kidding me? I don't get the memento because my inventory is full? Bye now, la la la. Does it just sit there and I can pick it up later? Uh, do I seriously not get the memento because of freaking inventory problems? No, don't leave! We need the thing! No, don't leave! We need the thing! No! We're gonna lose the thing! You and monkey girlfriend take care now. No, I don't want to lose the thing! <laughs> huh? What is it? A nut? Sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't. But my inventory is full for me! Received a nut. Good. Thanks. See you later, if we ever get the chance. No, we're gonna walk past that wall and then we won't be able to dance anymore and we won't be able to get back in here and then we won't be able to get the thing! No! The memento! The memento, why? No! Oh, okay, we can go back in. <laughs> and eat a mushroom. You ate a few- whoa, okay. Wow, that was pretty wild. It's probably not a good idea to eat too many of these mushrooms, though. Woo! <laughs> okay. So that's what the mushrooms do. I'll have to keep that in mind if I ever, uh, need to be in a psychedelic world, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what to do with that exactly. You drop the silver rattle into the baby cradle. As you do so, the crying of the baby ghost and the rocking of the baby cradle cease. You breathe a big sigh of relief. <gasps> like that. It's okay. now an empty cradle. Apparently the rattle just vanished. <laughs> Excellent point. Suddenly you hear a terrible rattling of chains from downstairs. Could it be the ghost of Christmas future? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Viewers, how many times are we going to get smashed by these things? All. Zero. <laughs> I was asking quick the jump, viewers, not you, d &H. <laughs> And then we just Hands fall back fine. down here, and we just okay. get into a nice little loop. <laughs> yes. Yeah. We'll just stay stuck. And then we fall <laughs> all the way down <laughs> here, and we get we into a nice We somehow managed loop. to barely squeeze through that little crack. <laughs> <laughs> and then we just jump down <laughs> here and get into an even longer loop. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I have a horrible drawing of what's in each of these. Okay, go to a position that I'll actually recognize. That would be very helpful. Please stop dancing! You're freaking me out! Okay, that one. Uh, take fur! <laughs> Kill me! <laughs> and he just runs away. What, the, okay, now I'm playing Whack-A-Mole! <laughs> uh, I'm playing Whack-A-Mole with a sword when I'm only carrying a dagger. Where did that come from? Man, those rocks are tough. Hello! Hello! Hi! The last thing you remember was fighting four of the king's lapdogs. Bannon, banana, do 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 do, banana, do 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 do. Anybody in, who's in my Discord chat knows that there's a joke related to that. Banan the warrior, re, 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 the ranger, Akimi the mage, and Yar Yar Weasel the priest. <laughs> Help! <laughs> Nice. <laughs> I'm using this intro anyway. <laughs> Hello, nice. this is Yaw Weasel. Okay, don't fall into a fire pit. That'll be death. Whoa, don't fall into a... What part of don't fall into a fire pit didn't you understand, tall Hederita boy? My name is Desdra Nightlake. The fuck? <laughs> I particularly love to beat up Khajiit kids. Do you now? Do ya? Cause you know what we love to do? Slaughter thugs! Slaughter thugs! Oh god! Oh no! <laughs> she said she was gonna kill me! She she threatened to murder me! Why are you attacking me? Oh, now I've killed a guard! What have I done? Ah, <sighs> no one is is interpreting it as a marriage request. Can't marry the guard. How about, uh, I could, you know, uh, to honor Rikisha's memory, I could marry into his family. That, you know, that, that is logical. I am flattered, but I'm afraid my tastes prefer more legs than you have. 
<laughs> the fact that they had that line on hand, they expected you to attempt to marry him. <laughs> And his reason isn't, you know, we don't know each other, or I'm sorry, I'm heterosexual. It was just, I prefer men with more legs. I, I, I don't, I shouldn't go towards a carcass, right? I should go towards living animals, because they have to have water to do the living. You know, it's one of those, it's one of those living things. You need water for, for doing the living thing, right? Boy, this sure is a small game map. Goes on forever. Uh, okay. I. It's turned to night. I've died. Oh my god. It's. Is this a video of a wolf dying? Wait. Glidepath died of thirst. Oh no. <laughs> Don't show me a video of a wolf dying! That's not cool! <laughs> that jump is really difficult, but evident- but, but, <laughs> Hi there, mushroom friend! I would love to, to grab you, but you're having a seizure. <laughs> there we go. Is that the best you can do, little man? No, I can throw another dagger at you. Yay! <laughs> I think I've got it. I think I've understood. That was tricky, because it is a motion-based puzzle. Demonstrably no. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and dive right in, and the single musical instrument of, of the day is... Yeah, that's right. It's air horn only. <laughs> air horn forever. <laughs> that music, though. I might not actually be able to tolerate having it this for this entire episode. <laughs> I do like how it just turns into a drone. <laughs> I can't even talk. <laughs> just listen. Just listen to it! <laughs> and dead. Oh god! Oh, I thought that was gonna be a much more dramatic explosion than it turned out to be. Now you're gonna give me bombs, right? And hopefully a save point? A save point would be appreciated. This is not a save point, it's a chest and probably another game feature. Save point? Save on that. You're not a save point either. This is a game for children. <laughs> I shouldn't be flummoxed by a game for children. <laughs> I feel very stupid. <gasps> yes, 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 yes! Yes! Oh, Weasel is the... Oh, Freud. <laughs> Freud. <laughs> danger, danger everywhere. I love that, and not a drop to drink. He's joining us too. That means we have more than a full compliment. What? Everyone else is gone? What? What? Where's Ilden? Where's everyone? How is Rouge gone? What? Did we even get their stuff back? Boy, I love how these enemies can kill my team with their Psy Starstorm Alpha. What am I supposed to do against Psy Starstorm Alpha? Honestly, there's nothing that's... I guess I could have Henry put on the uh, Psy Shield? Uh, that's what I'm supposed to do. That's what I'm supposed to do, guys. I'm supposed to have Henry put on the Psy Shield and not be an idiot. I'm pretty sure that's hitting him. Let me Let me get right up in his business. Yeah, this is doing nothing. That is, that is not a good technique. How about just, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Turn
Turns out, just had to hit him a bit with a sword. <laughs> Sometimes the, the tried and true is the right technique. What about the fly, honey? Wait, can I use it? Whoa, what did that do? Wait, 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 what did it do that I- Oh, I feel really stupid. Oh, I feel really stupid. The comments on the last video are gonna be like, Why didn't you do the thing that it told you to do, you dumb shit? <laughs> now are they gonna lay an egg? <laughs> Directly in response to food. Wow, you're well, gonna know a I lot mean, of food. That's two yes. chickens, man. That's only two chi- Stop! That's too much food! What are you doing? Jeez! <laughs> wow. That's like a chicken's weight worth of food. You just oh, I bet there's it. an egg- I bet there's an egg in the coop. Oh, this sucks. It's obvious that it's like trying to hint me at something, but I have no idea what. What is that telling me? What is that telling me? What is that telling me? Down arrow movie sign? I. What is that telling me? What is that telling me? Okay, let's see here. Oh, it's not yet night, it's just nightfall. <laughs> let's uh, pretend like I didn't come out here and just wait a couple more hours. <laughs> He just, he just sees you leave your room and then walk immediately back in. <laughs> I, I leave my room, look directly at him, <laughs> look suspiciously back and forth, and then walk back into my room. <laughs> He's like, that seems normal. That's how people behave. <laughs> so, I have no qualms with that. Dang it, go away, people. Stop Doesn't hanging. he know that you're a thief, too? Or does Vegan? he want to is he one of the ones who doesn't know that you're a thief? Oh, Sigurd definitely knows I'm a thief. That's yeah. why he wouldn't take the challenge. Yeah, yeah. So, so he sees a thief. Come oh, yeah, out right, of her right, room. right. He sees an established and known thief walk exactly. out of a room, look at her, look at him, <laughs> look suspiciously around, and then go back into her room. Hey, puppy! I got a runic stick for you. <laughs> You're gonna beat the puppy to death? No, I'm just gonna throw the stick. Oh, because it's a stick. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All the twitchy game timing. No, no, no! How did I? How did that even happen? I swear I was holding down the key. Oh man, is my keyboard broken? No, I'm just pathetic. I cannot twitchy game timing. And I won't be doing silly voices, because silly voices are annoying. Did Avalanche! He makes a T-Rex noise! <laughs> Except that we have no clue what noise a T-Rex made! <laughs> he makes a Jurassic Park T-Rex right. noise, aren't he? <laughs> Here's the real difficulty with the idea of... Uh, mapping. I am out of computers. <laughs> Normally, I map on one system and uh, uh, play on a different system. That's specifically difficult because I am playing on one system that's plugged into the, the printer and also playing on the other system because I've just like SSH'd into that system. <laughs> so, and, I mean, mapping is necessary, but uh, it's gonna be a bit tricky. Let me, let me get some paper. Uh, jeez, I also need the keyboard, of course. You know what? Is this a three computer game? Is this a, is this one of those three computer games? <laughs> you know the kind I mean, those three computer games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Christ. Uh, I mean, the map has been 100% consistent so far, I think. Um, okay, I, I'm just... Paper, paper, paper. I am in the power room. My bet is that the power won't last forever either, which is why I have not actually turned it on just yet. 
Uh, let me go ahead and re-announce the stream as I typically do. So I am writing this down. Obviously, you're not going to be able to see my paper, but you're just going to have to deal with that. Power room has an exit north. Uh, there are steel drums in the power room for some unknowable reason. <laughs> Okay, this corridor just has exits south and west. This has southeast and west. South then should probably be a room. This is the maintenance room. Uh... I can't carry a bunch of stuff! <laughs> I can't even carry the rope right now. So my thought is, once I turn on the, uh, the generator, I need to just, like, grab everything and get it onto the, uh, the, uh, the... The thing, the the balcony, not the balcony, but the uh, uh, fire escape, just to like get everything outside, you know. Uh, then I can deal with it later. Like I can deal with what I can and can't do things once I've gotten past the uh, uh, light issue. Okay, this corridor has north, east, south, south, now north is where I came from here. Yeah, this is the chemical store. Uh, and then, yes, east from the chemical store is the resuscitation chamber. And east from that is the air conditioning. Uh, and there's no other directions from here. Yes, okay. So let's see what's south here. Uh, yeah, that's the computer room. Uh, and it connects to the maintenance room. And then from here, yeah, I'm in the dark, so... There's the pa why are there steel dr oh maybe steel drums is not as in the musical instrument but just like drums made of steel okay that is set to uh uh like you know like uh uh drums you might use to contain something like uh <laughs> that kind of drums uh okay so uh if i turn the green There we go. <laughs> I really had to be very specific about it being a knob. West, west, west. Now I'm in stairs. Uh, and I can go up and down from here. No, I can only go up. There's no down. Uh, is there no down because... Nope, there's just no down. Okay. Uh, so that's kind of floor one. Floor two. I'm on the stairwells leading up and down, and as I recall, there's really nothing much to be done, uh, up. So I'm just going to ignore that. It's a featureless corridor. All directions, all directions. So I'm gonna have to redo kind of everything because I am mapping this time. Right, this was, this was the, uh... This just says who I am. Uh... 
or who I probably am. Uh, there's no other exits to this room. Uh, right, this dimly lit this dimly lit room is actually the uh, uh, dark room for photo processing. <laughs> It took me that long to remember the word dark room. That was not a joke. That was me attempting to remember the word dark room. Okay, I can't carry all of that. And only southeast and west from here, and then south was uh, the studio, right? Right, there's a hole in the ceiling. So possibly a way up from the studio. I have the rope, I think. I don't have the rope. Oh, of course, I can't take an unlimited number of things outside because the camera. Because the camera's like a countdown room. Yeah. I'm going to write that as having a camera trap. Large, strong door to the east. I never tried to open that door to the east. Yeah, okay, so that's, that's nothing. The security room is to the north of there. Metal plate above the door, right? Oh yeah, this has a slot. A slot for like a key card or something, but I didn't find anything resembling a key card. Okay, I, I, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't find anything I can definitely do with this. And... This is the reception hall. The ca- the co- the, <laughs> the cocktail cabinet was empty. And then, yeah, the, from here I can get out onto the, uh... Fire escape. So... I actually feel like I've done a pretty thorough investigative job here. Uh, insofar as... Nowhere else... Like, everywhere else needs some extra step. There's something west from the security room, there's something up from the studio. Okay, there's definitely more to do inside. I'm gonna drop everything in the studio and try to figure out where the rope was. Okay, I'm downstairs now. 
Okay, it's here. That makes sense. Why didn't I think of the stepladder? Of course a stepladder would help me... Uh, get into that hole in the ceiling. Okay, back up again. Uh... Actually, just drop all. Most normal people erect a ladder prior to climbing it. It's a step ladder. It's it's like pre-elect pre-erected. <laughs> ladder stands momentarily, wobbles, and then falls to the ground. Uh it's a step ladder, though. It's a st do, do they not know what a step ladder is? Because this is a step ladder. <laughs> Correct ladder against debris. Correct ladder, but that's in the middle of the room against white wall. Okay. So the ladder helps me less than I expected it to. I'm just gonna put everything in the studio so I know where everything is. <laughs> Now, I have not yet gotten everything from down below, so I'm going to bring up everything I can. That was a mistake. Wow, I can hold a coil of rope and a shovel. I must be strong. I'm very suspicious about that way up. I'm very suspicious about that way up. Okay, I got everything out of the maintenance room. That was everything downstairs. And that's more or less everything upstairs, too. Now, the only issue is I have no idea what to do at this point. <laughs> I cannot believe it's like, there's a step ladder, but we don't know what a step ladder is, so you can't use it. <laughs> uh... I'm trying to think, there's got to be a way into that, uh, into that thing, into that, th that hole in the ceiling, that, uh, that hole. Place ladder against hole. Apparently I'm wearing panties, good to know. <laughs> Passage upwards appears to be blocked by a lump of masonry. It appears to be a, that they're used to be an exit to the east. Doesn't seem to be anything I can do there.
Thinking, 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 thinking. I can technically get the ore from outside inside, but I don't know what that would achieve. I should really save in the empty room instead of this very full corridor. <sighs> There's a step ladder. Look at all this crap I have. I I just realized I am behaving like a ferret. I just I got absolutely every item in this entire area and just consolidated it in my secret place. There are various boxes. Tiny box. Should be a large box somewhere. Where's the large box? Oh, there it is. There's a large box and a tiny box and various boxes. <laughs> There's still a crystal sphere. Can I just sip the yellow fluid instead? Eh, no. <laughs> yes. You've burnt yourself from the inside out. Is there anything that needs burning? Is there anything that needs burninating? I am attempting to think. I am attempting to think. <laughs> Crystal Sphere is so mysterious. There's several things that just kill you. Did I open the ca plastic canister? I mean, it presumably just contains either, uh, uh, did, 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 did developer or fixer. Oh, there's an actual photograph in the canister. Oh my god. The image on the photograph is very fuzzy and indistinct. Look at photograph through sphere. Good. Look through sphere at photograph. Neat. The security room is a mystery. The hole in the ceiling of the studio is a mystery. What might I put in the security slot to convince it that I am secure? Nothing here. Not one of these items. To the right side of the panel is a slot. Once you've seen one slot, you've seen them all. I don't know what that phrase means. 
What could we put in the slot? Labels? Why would we put labels in the slot? Boxes? Candle? <laughs> Well, I poured some yellow fluid into the slot. Good for me. <laughs> Did that achieve anything? Well, now I don't have the yellow fluid anymore, so great. The slot contains a yellow fluid. <laughs> I wonder if the fluid uh, will explode. I can't just put anything into the slot. So the yellow fluid is probably something related to photography. We didn't get it from the dark room, but I just presume that if there's two poisonous fluids of it. Oh, wait, wait, but right, with the, the canister didn't actually contain a fluid. It contained a photograph. So we don't have the fixer or the... Uh, Huh. I don't actually have any evidence at all. I think what I need to do is this. Get lol. Let's just see if I can put everything there. No, no. Because of how the camera moves, because of how the camera moves, I cannot get every object in the game, or in the game so far, that is, outside. Interesting. 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 I wonder if opening the canister, like maybe the reason the photograph is blurry and indistinct is because it wasn't actually developed? But I don't have all of the stuff for developing photographs anyway. There's got to be some kind of rationale for that hole in the ceiling. Maybe it's just like how you interact with the ladder. Maybe there's some... So, I could put up the ladder, but again, it just wobbles and then falls to the ground. <sighs> 
There's got to be some way to use the ladder here. If it's a step ladder, then I should open the ladder. Or... Open the ladder. <laughs> or open the ladder, or is set up the ladder. Or... Uh... Hello, Nolly. I am being confused by ladders. <laughs> I mean, why would they call it a stepladder, other than the fact that the designers of this game don't know what a ladder is? If it's... if it needs to be set up against a wall, then it's not a stepladder, it's a ladder. <laughs> I can't just climb it... I mean, it's gotta have something to do with the ladder. Oops. Small opening near one edge of the play. Did I? That's locked, right? Okay, yes, I did do that. It just didn't do anything. Small opening near one edge of the plate. So I've got... A plate in the ground here that I also forgot about. <laughs> oh, I can carry the steel drums. Interesting. I did not realize that. I thought that they just on their own were too heavy to be carried. Okay, so we can turn it back off again. That feels pointless. How can I not play the steel drums? Okay, so erect ladder against drums. They're pretty heavy. Lean ladder against drums. Okay, let's look over at my word list. Can I get on the drums? I can't board the drums. Okay, so they, they probably are steel drums like the kind one plays. Uh, fight the drums, look into the drums, prod the drums, press the drums. Pray! I can pray! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> With inspect, donate. I mean, there's no way I can just climb the drums. If I hit the drums, do I play beautiful music? Hit drums with hand. Ouch. <laughs> I'm quite weak. Twirl. I can twirl clockwise, count, uh, counterclockwise, or anti-clockwise. I have all of those options. Track, trace. Tie to, talk, swim.
launch, lift. Smash. That's very annoying because... Is it, it can't be. No, okay. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's a step ladder. <laughs> it's supposed to be self whatever, self balancing. It's supposed to just stand. That's what a step ladder is. There's a slot in the security room that's very mysterious. There's actually another slot in the uh, maintenance room that's very mysterious. The maintenance room has a suggestion that you might be able to go down. This room, the studio, has a suggestion that you might be able to go up. But because I don't understand how to use a ladder, I can't do that. What are you doing, stepladder? asks Van Whitman, in defiance of all grammar. I didn't save when I got the steel drums here. The worst part is, there is a distinct possibility that I don't need to go up here, and I should be worrying about how to get out, and I should be worrying about outside, and the uh, stake, and the rope, but even if I am supposed to be... Hey, wait. Hey, wait, it's not updating. Game, what? Oh god, the game's not updating correctly. Uh, or rather, the, uh, the video obviously is, the, the, but the, uh, uh, one second, let me, let me see if I can fix that. I mean, given the sounds birds make, T-Rex is probably go, come on! <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's probably the sound T-Rexes make. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Yeah, he's, he's, he's not him. That, that's, that's a pig, a pig. sound. <laughs> I was, I was not. That was completely not the sound I was going for, what? which is the weirdest part. What like apparently, I for? don't know. Well, I was, I was just trying to do like a weird duck sound, just like duck <laughs> plus strangeness. I mean, and to be fair. There we go. Okay, I am going to give up on this area for the moment and worry about outside. But I can't go outside because of my... Well, I mean, I can go outside, but I can't achieve much outside because of my unbelievable girth. Can I destroy the camera somehow? No.
The various boxes are also very strange. <laughs> Ebels. I'm trying to decide if I can do anything about the camera or anything about any of this crap. Or anything into the slot in the security room. There must be something I'm missing. South, east, and west, yes. West, south is the dark room. Uh, turn on sync. I guess they did just say it's a sink, not that it's a faucet. Given that this is a dark room, it could literally just be a sink. Pull string. Yep, this is very much a dark room. Okay. So, uh, given that this is a dark room, I mean, the, the glow shouldn't be orange, it should be red, but let's just go with it. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm gonna get the canister, and the beaker, and the green bottle, and I'm going to assume that the green bottle is a developer. Uh, pull the string. So now this room is lit in orange. This is probably a three-way light, like off, on, or, uh, uh, dark room. Uh. So if I open this canister in the dark room, uh, and then crash the game because I'm an idiot. Cool, cool. I literally just crashed the game out of sheer stupidity. Okay, let's pretend like none of that happened. <laughs> Put photo in sync. Okay. Uh, pour beaker into sync. Pour water into sync. Open green bottle. Pour yellow fluid, fluid into sync. Okay, did I just do something? Get photo. No. The only fluid I had at hand seemed like the right fluid to me. <laughs> Yeah. 
if I really wanted to do this in total darkness, how would I do that? So I need to... Or more accurately, I think I can develop the photo. But... That room might be... That might be difficult. Because it won't let you do pretty much anything. Well, let's, let's try. Let's, let's see what happens. That was a mistake! Get canister, get a uh, green bottle, get beaker, northwest south, full string, full string again. Okay, so now it is completely dark in this room, and presumably I can do nothing. Open canister. Yeah. Is a candle too much light? I would assume so. Light the match. Light the candle. Open the canister. Look. I uh, get the photo, look at the photo, very fuzzy and indistinct. I really don't think that I'm achieving anything here. I would say I'm achieving less than nothing here. Huh, I think I did just eat the photograph. <laughs> yep, I did just eat the photograph. Cool, cool. <laughs> Seems more confusing than the first time I played Mist, says Dan in chat. Yep. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's go ahead and drink the yellow fluid and die. It did turn into a yellow solution. Interesting. So it did, like, there was something to doing that. That wasn't just completely stupid. Only mostly stupid. The thing is, typically, in a dark room, the reason it's allowed to have red light that is definitely not orange light is that the red light uh, uh, doesn't damage the photos while they're being developed. So that's why I assumed when I switched it to, to orange light mode, which isn't red light mode, that I would be able to develop the photo. Maybe I just did things in the wrong order? Maybe I'm supposed to... Okay, let, let's just try doing things in a different order. Uh, get canister, get beaker, get green bottle. I don't know how I would make sure that I've got the right quantities, by the way. Five parts border to one part developer. Open, green bottle, put. Uh, pour yellow fluid into sink. Uh, pour water into sink. Maybe I put the entire canister into the sink?
Develop photo. Let's look at the old list. <laughs> Let's look at the old command list. Uh... There's a wait for, wait for photo to develop. De I don't know how to spell develop, but doesn't matter anyway. Um, how long does it take for photos to develop? I have no idea. Let's just wait a bunch. It's still in the sink. It's reasonably palatable. You can eat a photograph, but you can't eat a plastic canister. Okay. <laughs> I don't quite follow the logic, but whatever you say, video game. Video game. This is not a video game. There's no video. It's text. This is a text game. Anybody have any suggestions, bearing in mind that uh, it might be entirely incorrect to even uh, develop this photo? It could just be a red herring. I can carry the rope, shovel, and hook all at the same time. Oops, I just dove right off the cliff. I was so busy doing stuff, I just dove right off the cliff. Good, good for me. Can I get multiple things? Get, uh, rope... Uh, hook, and, uh, shovel. Yes, yes I can. That's helpful. Those are just the things that are most likely to m let me climb down. You are spraying rubble everywhere by digging the ru rubble. Can I, like, dig up the stake? That's a pretty good way to break a shovel. Uh... Dig ground. Put... Attach? Attach? Fight what? <laughs> no. Not... Not attack, attach. Uh, drill. 
an interesting option. Uh, as I recall, hint is not actually a thing. No hints, granddad. Bastards. <laughs> Can I just, like, make the steak better? This is very annoying. Well, time to die. I swear the focus gets worse every time I do that. <laughs> There's another situation where you just think. The last time I had to just sit down and think for a long time. The last time I just had to sit down and think for a long time, it was because the buttons, there was a specific order to them. Now there could be a specific order to the things in the dark room, but I don't yet know of a reason to do anything with the dark room. The ladder. So we've got a photograph I don't know how to develop. We've got a hole in the ceiling that I can't get to in spite of having a stepladder. Ooh, 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 ooh. The ground here is too uneven to erect the ladder. Well, it was a good thought. Above you is a balcony, unfortunately, is just out of your reach. I figured if only I had a step ladder. How about if I jump for the balcony? Cool. I don't think you can climb the wall. Like, rope plus hook equals, uh, grappling hook, which could get me up to the balcony, except that I can't tie the rope to the hook. I thought maybe I could climb up. Well, that doesn't work. There's no window on this level, making it not a useful fire escape. <laughs> I mean, this, this could be all a red herring. That's very possible. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Okay, here are the mysteries I have right now. On what can be presumed to be the ground floor. 
There is a possible way down from the maintenance room, but it's through a hatch I can't open. There is... Uh, I guess nothing else on the first room. And then on... Oh, it's the first floor, that is. And then on the second floor... There is a door in the security room that I can't do anything with. There's a door in the, uh, the camera trap room that I can't do anything with. And there's a way up that I can't get to. There is a dark room with the makings of a photograph to develop, but no, no, no technique I could find actually worked. The yellow liquid plus water equals yellow solution, so mixing those does do something. What if I pour the stuff into the canister instead of the, uh... Instead of the sink? I just assumed it had to be in the sink because that makes sense. I can eat a photograph, but I can't eat any of this other stuff. Okay, I can eat- I can eat a stained leaflet. That I can eat. I can eat labels. <laughs> I- I can't eat a box. What about a tiny box? I can't eat a match. <laughs> Did I try the candle? Nope, can't eat a candle. <laughs> think, think, think. The test command is clearly some stupid joke. The labels are blank. I'm lost. <sighs> the slot in the security room Part of me thinks it is the photograph itself that needs to go in there. If I could spell canister, that would help. Seems just as cryptic as I imagined it to be, says Master Hagen. Great. 
The photograph is instantly rejected. But if the photograph had been developed, then it would use some kind of, you know, face recognition, whatever, to recognize the photograph. And that would open the door. So, I mean... Uh, let me get something else that will probably fit into the slot and see if it's also instantly rejected. The fact that the photograph was instantly rejected means that there is some significance to the photograph and the slot. The only question is, can I figure out how to develop the photograph? And, is photographic developer yellow? <laughs> Okay, let's get the green bottle, the beaker, and the canister. Uh, 31, there we go, we'll save to 31. So we are now in, like, the right level of glow to develop things, possibly. Oh, so I can't over, or I can't pour the yellow fluid directly into the beaker. Nor can I pour the water into the green bottle. <laughs> I don't know the word five. See, like, when I mix the water and the yellow fluid, it becomes a yellow solution. There is no way that that's a coincidence. I wonder... So now, it is total darkness. Does it need to be... Like... I don't know anything. I don't know anything. The problem is, now I can't even pull the string to get back some light. There is some specific order that all this has to be done in, I would assume. <laughs> Ouch, that's smart. The intense burning sensation caused you to drop the burning object, which burns to, to leave a small amount of ash. The ash is instantly scattered by a slight draft. So that we don't have to have ash be an object in the game. <laughs> well, that was pointless. <laughs> How would one develop this photo 
in complete darkness. Or this could be a red herring. I feel like I probably have everything I need to develop the photo. I feel like the reason the photo is fuzzy and indistinct is because it's not been developed. Or, it hasn't even been exposed. If it hasn't even been exposed, then that's particularly useless. It is edible. You can eat a photo. The photo almost certainly goes in the slot. Is there something I can do to do this in actually total darkness? I mean, I could turn off the light in this room. I could turn off the light in this room, and all rooms, from the power station. Or the power room, rather. Don't they typically... Okay, wait. I do have a metal hook. And I believe you would typically, like, put the photo in the, the developer and then to fix it, you would, or uh, not to fix it, then to develop it, you would hang it, right? Like, okay. Steps to developing a photo. Let's see what Google has to say about this. Mix the chemistry, load the film for development, pre-wash or pre-soak your film, develop your film, add the stop bath and a fixer, hang up your film to dry. So the hanging is just to dry. You need a developer and a fixer, and I definitely don't have both. I wonder if I can drain the sink somehow.
Maybe I'm supposed to pour all this into the canister. Maybe that's the problem. Okay, I definitely can't hang the photo from the hook. <laughs> Okay, so I can, in fact, pour it all into the canister. Well, that has surely achieved something. I would almost bet that there is an exact sequence that allows you to develop this photo. Here's a silly thought. Okay, so I can't, I can't overflow the slot with water, but I can pour the yellow fluid into the slot. And the photo won't fit now due to the uh, fluid in the slot. <laughs> well, better slurp up that fluid. <laughs> Think, 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 think. It is not a certainty that I have everything I need to develop this photo. It is probable, but it is not certain. There is an ore outside. But I'm betting the ore is for later. I think the photo... Wait, can I pour things into the canister without opening it? Like, does it have a, a valve or something? It's not open. I'm just looking at the uh, list of commands off to the side, see if anything seems suspicious. The, uh, Crystal Sphere is also pretty suspicious, obviously.
we have assuming that the yellow fluid is relevant we have everything we need to develop well but okay you need a developer and a fixer you need a developer and a fixer it wouldn't have told you that you need a developer and a fixer if you didn't need a developer and a fixer so the fact that i only have one solution is wrong anyway I'm just poking around, in case you thought I was, uh, doing something brilliant here, I'm just poking around. I haven't done anything with the computers. It, it says it's useless. It says right there that it's useless. Small opening near one edge of the plate. Does the sphere belong in the opening? Thinking of things that could possibly help to open that. The hook comes away in your hand. Fear won't fit. Large steel plate set in the floor. Small opening near one edge of the plate. Maybe the rope? Tie hook to opening. No. Uh, somebody needs to be banned.
I never even titled this stream. Lol. Well, we're three and a half hours into a four hour stream. Too late to title it now. I think I'm just going to need to play this on my own a bit and poke around and see if I can find anything. It's just, there's so much stuff in this area. And I guarantee you that some of it can be dealt with, but there's like a specific order. Uh, rotate plate. The opening near the edge of the plate, which you can stick a hook into, but it just puts it in there. <laughs> There's no attach command. Let's try... No, this is not going to do anything. I am completely wasting my time. We did it! I put some yellow fluid in this random opening! <laughs> oh, there are so many mysteries! Like that opening, if I had a crowbar... I would presume that you would use that to, to pry open the metal plate. That's my assumption about the purpose of that opening. So where do we stand? There is a slot in the security room that probably takes a photo but rejects the photo we have because there is a dark room in which we can't develop the photo because I don't know the sequence of steps and or am mix missing a step, probably the fixer. There is a steel plate in the maintenance room with an opening that I can't figure out how to do anything with. 
And there are just so many objects that I have no idea about. None whatsoever. Oh yes, and in the studio there's a way up that I can't get to because my character doesn't know how a ladder works. I got nothing. I, I mean, nobody's watching anyway, but I don't suppose anybody who's watching <laughs> has, like, read a walkthrough and could tell me <laughs> some hint as to the next step, because... This is definitely a case of, like, you just need to figure out that one step that then unlocks a bunch of stuff, and I'm betting the step is just the order to do things in for the dark room. Well, no, because again, I don't have the fixer. Uh... Oh, debris, not rubble. I'm so sorry. Through the hole, you can see a white ceiling. So there is a room above, duh! Wow. Why is there a suicide command? <laughs> Scratch, scratch, tear, rip, splurge, blood squirt, squirt, court case, incommoding the passerby, passersby, claret everywhere. Congratulations, mission accomplished. <laughs> I would, you don't even get to know how you killed yourself, just that somehow you found a way to kill yourself. <laughs> Can't use the rope to climb up. Boy, right at the beginning of this stream, there were people suggesting stuff constantly, and then everybody went, oh, this is boring, and left. <laughs> Y'all vote for this game, and then nobody watches because it's boring, because it's this game. <laughs> I don't know why labels would help. So I'm I'm fairly certain that developed photo goes in slot.
I keep forgetting you can get multiple things at once. <laughs> We know that this room is dimly lit, and we know if I pull that once, then the lighting becomes orange. But the lighting is really supposed to be red. I mean, did I even try doing this without, uh, without pulling the string, without changing the light level? You know what I didn't try? I didn't try actually clicking this once I had the candle so I could. Soft orange glow. Gone. Why could I see in this room at all? Okay. 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 Okay, now it is dark. When I'm in the dark, can I still... Yes. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> the question was, when I'm in the dark, can I still move about? And the answer is yes, kind of, but I might fall badly. <laughs> okay, here is my plan. I suspect that you can turn on the orange light even when the power is out. So if I have all of this stuff... Up, east, south... Uh, well, there was no reason to do that in the dark. That was just stupid. <laughs> Actually, what I should have done... Okay, okay, no, 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 I'm, I'm being dumb. Uh, yeah, yeah, that, that didn't make any sense. Let me try that one more time. Uh, I need the green bottle, the beaker, the uh, uh, da -da candle, the canister, and the tiny box. North, west, south. Pull string. Yeah, I think there's just something weird about the, uh, combination of stuff here. Uh, turn red knob. Northwest, west. West, up, east, south. No. No. Can't even open the tiny box. Whoops. Uh, light match, light candle, west, up, east, south. Oh. 
Okay, okay. So now this room is properly dimly lit rather than extra dimly lit or whatever the hell was going on before. Uh, or is it? Yes, yes it is. Okay, this, this room is dimly lit in orange. Uh, open canister. Pour water into canist- into eye canister. Pour fluid into canister. Great, we did it. <laughs> Dang it, I must have figured out something! Because <laughs> the dimly lit room is the only room that you can light with no external illumination. And you need the dimly lit room, which is... Okay, the, the, the dark room. You need the dark room's illumination to do anything. What the? Now I'm carrying the large box. What? <laughs> Is the save format busted so that it doesn't know what box I'm carrying? It swapped the large box to the tiny box? I think, I think this is just the save format being busted. I don't think that was supposed to happen. I also don't have the canister. Wait, what? Oh, I was in the wrong save. Okay, just, it, it's fine, everything's great. It is not a coincidence that this room can be lit without needing the generator. It is not a coincidence. It is not an accident. There is some reason why this room can be lit without the generator. Can't look through the solution. So I opened the canister in the solution. If there's any hope of anything being correct, this is it. Okay, uh, next week. <laughs> We're a bit early, but I'm a lot stuck, so I think I'm going to uh, give up on this for now. Sometime during the week, I'm going to have to figure out whether I can make progress. I think if I can make any kind of progress that I am willing to continue playing this game, but if I can't, then it might be time for yet another game. <laughs> So great. Uh, I really felt clever doing that, and it did not work out. It did not work. It did not accomplish anything. Did not work. 
yeah yeah okay next next uh, yeah next next week next week next week